in one of your articles, you wrote recently that the world has become a spaghetti ball of uh, interlinked free trade agreements. And if I were, were to use that metaphor, I think the Eurasian Customs Union uh, is not to everybody's taste. And uh, again, there are concerns. Uh, you didn't voice them, but they are voiced constantly that Russia is using uh, its economic activity to promote its geopolitical agenda. Obviously, Russia would argue that the West has been doing that for many, many decades. I wonder, though, if this current crisis, not just the Ukrainian crisis, but the uh, wider geopolitical crisis is going to affect how this ball of spaghetti is cooked, how it's seasoned and how it's consumed. Exactly. I fear it can become into many smaller balls of spaghetti that have no integration between them. And, and that is my point on make, turning regional integration into building blocks to global integration instead of becoming a stumbling stone where countries that engage in regional integration suddenly say, okay, we've done it here in our region, so we don't need to trade with anybody else. We need to open them up, especially also for the poorer countries in the region and in the world, because they can easily be left out of the spaghetti bowl. And, and there they will, it's become very bit difficult to penetrate into it. So we need a global economic integration uh, of all states in harmonious trade also as a long-term vision. Does and, this and every regional integration effort, the Eurasian Economic Union, the European mm -hmm. Union, the NAFTA, the Mercosur, all yes. of them are met, of course, with resistance and skepticism from countries that are not part for good reasons, because they can close themselves and they can become closed uh, regional integration efforts. And we need to maintain the vision of opening up regional integration agreements and building, creating building blocks for, for more do, do we need uh, a chef in charge of all this yeah. cooking process? And we who could be that chef? We have a chef, the World Trade Organization, and partly the UN, with some of our mandates on the economic sphere. We are uh, two chef, chefs uh, trying uh, to steer the... the, but, the, the Mr. Buck, the,